Hi, YouTube. Um, the last time I was on here, I mentioned that I wanted to color my hair. And I did that. Um, I used the um, South Sheen Carson by Dr. Lovely. Um, Midnight Blue, 382. This one right here. And that's the 382 color. Um, I was scared at first, but I, uh, I got some advice from a couple of other naturals, and they said everything will be cool. Um, while I was doing it, I did notice that um, I thought it actually was going to change the texture of my hair by putting this chemical on there, but it really didn't. It made my curls actually pop more you know why it was wet so that's a plus um and I also um once I colored it and everything I decided to stretch it so this was the first time I blew out my hair um in a year so using the um blow dryer I didn't use it um on hot, I used it actually on cool, and I didn't get it completely dry. Um, I got it like semi-dry, and um, once I dried it, I did notice um, that the texture of my hair felt a little more coarse than it did before, but I, I needed to add moisture back in, so um, I used the, um, the uh, conditioner that came actually in the um, packet which was really good and you leave that on for three minutes um, but I also use my Swaz Professional Sleek that um, I always use as an additional conditioner and I left that on about maybe about 30 minutes and sat under the dryer um, after I sat under the dryer then I you know detangled um, and blew it out semi blew it out and what I use to add moisture back in is uh, my actual handy dandy that I told you guys I was using because I don't see no issues with it. My parents used it back in the day and it works for me. But the Blue Magic Coconut Oil Hair Conditioner, I use that. And also give it a little more moisture and feel softer. I use the uh, Shea Moisture Curl Enhancing Smoothie. And um, that gave it a little more moisture, but um, it stretched it. So these are the twists that I have in right now as protective styles. Uh, I got them like really pink back and up out the way but um whew, that's another thing with it but um just pinked up so my twist when I let them go they'll be stretched out I don't know if um let's see if we got any curl definition here yeah so got a little stretching on it so it'll be okay I guess I'm gonna leave these twisted up until I go to work on Monday and then um, poof it out it looks like it's gonna turn out alright but I'm liking it like this I had to run to the grocery store so um, I didn't want my little pickaninnies all over the place. So I just pinned it up and pinned it back and put on the headband. And uh, I actually might rock this as a protective style this week. Who knows? Um, I'm trying to figure out what I could do to get this color off my fingernails. Even though I wore the uh, gloves, I actually wore two sets of gloves. I still got the black fingernails. The dreaded color of the black fingernails. Um, but yeah, I think everything went good. My hair doesn't feel any kind of strange way. It actually feels soft 
and conditioned. Let me turn around to the back so you guys can see the back. I just actually got it like pinned up. I hope y'all can see that. I don't know. But yeah. I just did that and threw my little rock my butt headband on. And we're going to see how that turns out this week. Okay, I'm not going to hold you guys long. I just wanted to stop in and show you guys that I did color my hair. And um, I'm pretty pleased with the results. And I will talk to you guys later. Bye.